Oh my god. Okay. Thank you, chat. There have been hard prayers, decryption, litanies, and blessed crypto purification viruses did their work. Every turret in the vicinity instantly turned on the traitors, and the dock filled with gunfire and screams. When silence fell, the gate opens before us. Okay. It took us many days to break through the to the metal heart of the Manufactorum. On the third week of the assault, the Vanguard was halted and swept away by a salvo of plasma macro cannons. Scorning every cannon of sacred engineering, the heretics had placed the hull of an unfinished void cruiser on treads several kilometers long. This leviathan of adamantine and plasteel barred our way. Logus Opticon 22 insisted that we retake the sacred machine, for the vessel had been in the making for many decades, and its destruction would mean mean a great tragedy for the Imperium. It came as a surprise to all when Space Wolf Thorbald supported the Magos Dominus. After the Lord Captain had reconciled him with the Explorators, Leader Thorbald had tamed his pride and spoken in favor of the Tech Priest's cause, liberating the Noble Machines. Commanded the Sacred Vessel be reclaimed from the enemy's clutches. Boom. Yes! Having the Sacred Machine on our side can be given our offense a sizable edge. Our orders were to get a landing force on the cruiser's bridge and escort the engine seers to the main cogitator. Our shuttles used the turret's blind stop to deploy elite troops on the board, uh, on board the cruiser. While they were engaged with the shrieking heretics, the engine seers reasoned with the machine spirits of the main cogitator and initiated a blessed purgitation protocol on the inner decks. It took us three days to drag every last cultist corpse out of the compartments. Woo! Man. Banalin, thank you so much for the T1. I really appreciate it, buddy. Thank you. Slipping on pools of blood mixed with sacred unguents, we made it to the Machine Cathedral, a gargantuan hall breathing with the, with the flames of a thousand furnaces, the last bastion of the enemy army. That was where I first faced the world bearers, betrayers of humanity and unworthy sons of the emperor. What could we, mere humans, possibly do to match their unholy bestial rage? Because the Lord Captain ordered the entirety of our main forces to begin the operation with a swift assault, the enemy troops were still in disarray, and not all word bearers squads had had the time to regroup at the Machine Cathedral. They were scattered around the battlefield and could not retaliate with a unified strike. This gave us a chance to surround and crush their squads one by one. I devised a plan that placed the Space Wolves at the forefront of our strike. The Emperor's Angels themselves led the charge that day. Magnificent in their rage, they forged a path for us to follow, and even the appalling champions of the arch enemy could not stop them. While we distracted the enemy with suppressing fire and a hail of grenades, our unyielding leaders charged the word bears and tore them to pieces. We were the anvil of his wrath, and they were the hammers. Oof! Oof! Like goosebumps. And that's when it came doom scream an ancient and bloodthirsty transformer a merciless executioner forged from adamantine and ceramite a single foe was repelling our assaults one after another turning hundreds of soldiers into a bloody pulp for as long as that abomination lived we had no hope of reaching the heart of the enemy citadel holy smokes co you're still playing this is this the same run from the start i've skipped watching this as i'm also playing i didn't realize it would be so huge yes this is my first playthrough of this game. We are over 100 hours and uh, and still, still loving it. Still loving it. Yep. <laughs> okay. The diorite Thorbald volunteered to track down and destroy the vile spawn, but fate had other things in store for him and his brothers. The Space Wolves pack was to be the first to storm the Machine Cathedral, and thus Magus Dominus Opticon 22 assembled a cohort of elite Skitari and said that he would locate and eliminate Doom Screen. Soldiers were whispering that he would he was willing to activate the so-called guaranteed annihilation protocol. Uh-oh. A terrible and ominous rite that is as lethal to the enemies of the Omnissiah as it is his faithful servants. Oh no. Oh no. Question the survivors. Dude, no, we're gonna have to do this again and we're gonna have to hit this 25. <laughs> oh, there's no way we're gonna get that. Yeah. Oh, oh no, it's a heresy. It's a 
It's a heresy heavy bolter? Dude. I'm so sad right now. Oh, man. Okay. We're going to do this again. We gotta hit that 25, man. We failed. I know we failed the last check. Sigh. Freaking sigh, man. Of course, it'd be the very last check. Mm. Uh, this one. What's wrong with Little Heresy? No, there's nothing wrong with Little Heresy. Every so often. Did anyone try the TTS mod for this game? If yes, how well does it work? There's a TTS mod for this game? Nanny. Really? Does it work? What have I been doing this whole time? I don't know. Oh no. Oh, do we not get a chance to save until after this fight? Oh, we, do oh my God. Do I have to do this fight every time I scum that option? Mother of God, what am I? Okay. I never realized why you don't just save at the page and reload for that. Oh, you can't save in the in the All hands prepare in that for thing. acceleration. Yeah. Let the void sort them out. You can just save before killing the ship. Oh, that's a good point. Can't do that, can't we? With the force of a supernova! Make every shot count. Lance batteries, volley! Yeah, we'll pop this on. Okay. Why did this come out with three? Oh, I didn't, I didn't, oh no. Oh. Hmm. Fire at will. Lance batteries, volley. Let them taste our fury. This thing is kind of beefy. Uh, I need to move, please. How, how, do, how do I move? Um, I guess we can just do this. Helmsman, take us in. Macro cannons, open fire! Torpedoes away. Okay. Hell yeah, get him. Oh, it's fine. Yeah, dude, if, if someone can link me the TTS mod, I, I definitely want to try it. Oh, 
big hits. Oh my, oh my lord. Gonna kill that poor man. Smite the enemies of oh, he's, humanity. He's in for blood, okay. Oh, he did already. Thank you. The enemy's void shield has been nullified. All hands prepare for acceleration. With the force of a supernova. Proceed accordingly. You love to see it, chat. You love to see it. Coordinate set. If you plan on using that mod, make sure to also grab the mod that allows you to still unlock achievements. Oh, dude, I, I don't care about that. <laughs> Thank you, though. Engage the engines. Helmsman, take us in. All clear. Congratulations, say. Lord Captain. Oh, we could have just saved it here, too. Okay save so let's let's try this real quick i'm i'm kind of curious about this let's give it a try let's install it and let's give it a try mm -mm -mm -mm. let me log into my nexus account do, 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 do. Please validate your email. Girl, what you talking about? Oh, yeah, there it is. Reactivate my account. What do you mean reactivate? I'm, I'm still paying for you. Reactivate my account. Girl, what you talking about? You're still charging me money. Okay. Um, Manual download. Got it. I've never installed a mod for this before, so let's see here. It is under of development. We can add more languages in if we want to. Oh. Okay. So first, grab the mod name. There it is, 40k speech mod. Then I go to user. And then I go to, what was it? App data, local, low, alcat. Okay, Warhammer 40k, Unity mod manager. And do I just drop the whole folder in here? Yeah, copy the folder into that folder. Okay, there we go. Launch Warhammer, and you may need to hit Control F10 to see the Mod Manager window. Okay. Backup saves just in case. That would have been the smart thing to do. Yeah, but I'm not very smart. It's fine. Oh, look at this. Whoa. You can do the speech rate. Set the nationality. Speech mod for Warhammer 40k. Rogue trader. Female voice speech test. Okay. Speech mod for Warhammer 40k. Rogue trader. 
Narrator voice speech test. Speech mod for Warmer 40K, Rogue Trader, Narrator voice speech test. Speech mod for Warmer 40K, Rogue Trader, Narrator voice speech test. Speech mod for Warmer 40K, Rogue Trader, Narrator voice speech test. Speech mod for Warmer 40K, Rogue Trader, Narrator voice speech test. Speech mod for Warmer 40K, Rogue Trader, Narrator voice speech test. Let's try it. I'm assuming it just doesn't like read everything out all the time, right? Yeah, I know. We need to find like, we need to find like a mechanical voice, like a super AI. Like, we we got. How do I hire Pascal's voice actor? <laughs> you know what would be interesting? Somebody said, okay, I'm gonna say something that's gonna blow your minds here, but but I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna say this out loud because I think this would be amazing. Somebody a couple days ago I was talking to said, you know how some streamers have AI voice packs of like super popular voice actors that they use for their TTS? I was like, yeah. And they go, why don't you get one of those made for your voice and then just have that read out text in these games? And I said, Nanny. That's a great idea. <laughs> like, like maybe I should try to figure out how to do that. That's kind of a great idea. Yeah. Like, I imagine if I could just load my own voice into this mod. <laughs> I was like, that's a damn... Okay. So how does it... Autoplay dialogue enabled. It's not working? Um, oh, maybe it's not for this stuff. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. When in dialogue mode, you can now press the play button left to the left of the image. When inspecting a book. Oh, Lexica, Lexica, Lexica. Not implemented yet. Okay. So it's not, it's in book event, not implemented yet. Okay. 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 So we got to wait for that. That's fine. That's fine. It's all good. Wow. Good start. Good start. Good start, chat. Okay. That's the, that's the check we got to get right there at the end. And actually, what we can do, I think I could probably put some weapon skill items on Abelard for that check. Make things a little easier. Yeah. Dude, I wouldn't. Oh, yeah. Somebody. I, I I wouldn't even know who to talk to about making an AI version of my voice. Like, I don't. I don't even know what that entails or how it works or. Yeah, I, I need to I need to look into all that. Oh, Tangia offers that service already. I've never I've never heard of that. What's Tangia? Oh. Oh, look at that. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, maybe I'll look at this. Cool. Thank you. Thank you. Great. Mm -mm. Dude, I wonder if I could... <gasps> Wait a second. Could I make 
my own voice packs of my own funny voice and then have those randomly read on screen text. So I wonder if like I could click on this, right? And it would randomly pick like, I don't know if Carl's voice is this approved. I could click on this to be like, you could also take Elvin Labs and Elvin Labs adds to Twitch messages. And just like make entire voice packs that are just ridiculous voices and just cycle through them. <laughs> I should totally do that. Your world is your oyster. I know, right? I know. Now I'm getting all these like weird and dumb ideas on things we could do with that. <laughs> oh man. Oh, I was going to do this first. Hold on. Okay. I'm pretty. Oh wait, you can search. Weapon skill. There we go. Oh, it's so handy. Um, I thought we had gloves and stuff that added weapon skill. Whenever the warehouse has two melee weapons equipped. Uh, uh, dang. Yeah, I thought we had a, a lot more weapon skill plus stuff. I guess not. Mm -hmm. Let's just go ahead and scum scum this save like you know all know we want to. <clears throat> oh, Hendrix may have it. He might. He might. That's a good point. Wow, that's like the second time I failed a seventy-five chance in a row. This is going swimmingly. Doctor Nucleotides with one hundred and seven months, and he says, "Good show. Thanks, buddy." How much is this check? Hold on. Maybe I misread it. I thought it was 75. Is it not that? <laughs> oh, barely. No, I think it means whenever there's two weapons equipped, like dual wielding. Yeah. At least I think. Right. We're going to get this. If you really do the voice one, can we select what voice for the message when you create the Kovatar? Oh, I... Oh, dude. That is such an interesting idea. If I got a bunch of AI voice packs that were, of course, signed off on by the people who actually made them, whose the voice was modeled on. And then I could have you, like, have you pick your own custom voice for your Kovatar that reads it out if I put it on the screen. I'll have to think about that. I'll have to think about that. No code, that would be on YouTube, too. Oh, uh, that has nothing to do with YouTube. Yeah, that, that would have nothing to do with YouTube. Hmm. And we can just get rid of Ko. I know we're getting so close to being able to just get rid of me. I am excited. This first check is a doozy. Oh my lord. These here are okay. Here's the big one. Hey! What happened next would become legend. The Lord Captain at the head of his retinue challenged the bloodlusting Kersayark that had crawled out of the darkness of time. He dealt the wicked executioner a heavy and mortifying blow and thus Doom Scream was routed. The abomination's torn pincher fitted with an ancient and powerful bolter became the rogue trader's rightful trophy. Awesome. Awesome. At last we reached the machine cathedral. We saw a yawning lift shaft uh, left behind by a colossal land gnawing drill that had burrowed for kilometers into the depths of the planet. There deep below lay the last hiding place of the heretic leaders. Hundreds of grenades accompanied by promises of swift judgment were hurled into the pit. Such was our righteous anger. The planetary assault was a resounding success. The enemy forces were shattered and broken. A small fraction remained in the machine cathedral, but the rest either 
have been destroyed or were destined to meet the same inevitable fate soon. Lord Captain's retinue and Space Wolves band delved excuse me delved into the shaft, headed towards the heart of the Machine Cathedral. We watched them leave with reverence in our eyes as we were setting up a perimeter around the entrance. We knew that the true outcome of the Battle of Euphrates II depended on them, and that our fates were theirs to decide. Oh! I can't get over the writing of this game! It's so good! Oh, so good. Toad's just gonna automate all interactions with chat so he can just play games. That's right. That's the, that's the end goal. That's the end goal. Right there. Yep. Mm-mm. Uh, mm, mm, mm. Okay. The dark corners of the Imperium are infested with scoundrels, criminals, heretics, and even minions of the archenemy. Exterminating them is the duty of every righteous servant of the God Emperor. I... I agree completely. May the energies of the Immaterium, oh my lord, may the gears resume turning, may the batteries be infused by the blessed poison of the unreal. Oh, this doesn't look good. Oh god. The giant clad in dark crimson armor is in the middle of a sinister litany, his words turning into a repulsive ethereal stench and flakes of otherworldly ice. He does not notice your presence. The same cannot be said about Kunrid Voigtver who stands at his side. His completely mutated turquoise eyes flash upon seeing you. He flinches but remains silent, hesitant to interrupt the ritual. Dude, look at him! He's got like a third eye now and... Oh, he is, he's just gone. He's just gone. I think I think I want to go back to the guy. Let's see. Let's try this guy. Speech mod for Warhammer 40k. Rogue trader. Female voice speech test. Speech mod for Warhammer 40k, Rogue Trader, Female Voice Speech Test. Speech mod for Warhammer 40k, Rogue Trader, Female Voice Speech Test. That's almost there. That's almost there. I, w I was trying to make it sound like super robotic. Speech mod for Warhammer 40k, Rogue Trader, Male Voice Speech Test. Oh, this is narrator voice. Speech mod for Warhammer 40k, Rogue Trader, Narrator Voice Speech Test. Okay. Wow! 5% chance. Watching this loathsome act of desecration take place before you fills your head with an unnerving sensation. You realize you will forever remember these disturbing, in human words the sorcerer is speaking, they have embedded themselves in your memory in place of something, important that was there before. Try as you might. You cannot remember what it was. That should be a little bit slower. Right now. The sorcerer does not turn his head as his voice rolls over the room. I see you, mortal thing. I sense your meek mind. Is that better? The sorcerer reluctantly turns his burning gaze upon you. So you are the one who was so eager to meet me and your own demise. Rejoice, Brother Twilight. Today, you become the new rogue trader. Voigtber's deformed features twist into a bloodthirsty smile. Yes, Master. I will rectify my mistake and reclaim what was stolen. Examine the machine. The platform beneath the sorcerer's feet is the drilling machine's massive tunneling shield. This mighty mechanism can gnaw through underground rock, bunker bulkheads reinforced with adamantine, or anything else that may lurk in the planet's depths. The corrupted servants of the Deus Mechanic use scuttle around a heretic, muttering twisted prayers of ignition in attempts to persuade the omniscient's majestic beast to awaken and rend the world's flesh. Do you have a name, or shall I simply refer to you as the heretic? You know my name well. I am Eurylin the Cruel, 
breaker of misbelievers, truth speaker, triumvator of faith, dark apostle of the blessed word bearers legion. Kneel and offer a prayer of gratitude, for your death could not bear a worthier name. Yeah, I'm not sold on the voice. I, th I feel like it would have to be an actual person's voice. I've, it's a little bit, it's a little bit too distracting for me as like a standard voice. Yeah. Hold on. Uh, did we save when we got in here? Yeah, auto save when we came in. Okay, great. All right, I'm gonna go take it. I'm gonna go take the mod out. It's a really cool idea, but it's just, it's too, it's just too, it's too normal. It's no Amelia Tyler. We've all been spoiled. Pretty much. Yeah. Yeah. I'm glad we tried it though, but it's just, it's just not there. Okay. Come back in. It needs more work. It's still a work in progress. Well, I mean, the mod itself is badass. It's just the voice. I feel, I feel like the voice needs to be better. Yeah. Which, which has nothing to do with the mod. I mean, it's just, that's, you know. And I think it actually said there's a way to put in custom voices, so I may look into that later. But until I get something that sounds more natural, it's just a little too, a little too jarring. Yeah, I was like reading the words and still like wasn't fully understanding what was going on. Like it, it just wasn't. Yeah, it wasn't working. For it. It wasn't working. Yeah, it's like that was like the standard Microsoft Sam voice or whatever. Mm -hmm. Oh shoot, is it already three? Larg. I was gonna work on VR this afternoon, but I wanna keep playing this. <laughs> okay. Okay. 